Hello everybody, Clayton here at eTrailer.com. Here at eTrailer, we install, test, and review a lot of different products to help you as a customer make a more educated decision before your purchase. Today, we're gonna to be working on a 2018 Ford Focus. We're gonna be taking a look at, and I'll be showing you how to install Roadmaster's stoplight switch. Our stoplight switch is going to send a signal to our indicator light or our coach link system in this case, letting us know that the brakes are being applied. And how this works is there's a little plunger that hits the brake pedal arm and that's compressed whenever it's touching the arm. When that brake pedal pushes down, that plunger extends, sending the signal. You might be asking yourself, why do I need a stoplight switch to flat tow? Well, in this case, for our focus, the key is not in the ignition, so our brake pedal switch on the brake pedal is not gonna get a signal. Adding our stoplight switch connects directly to our battery, allowing it to get power, and that is gonna send a signal to our indicator light or our coach link monitor letting us know the brakes have been applied. Our stoplight switch is gonna mount directly to our brake pedal arm. It's kind of hard to see here. It's way up underneath our dash, but there's a bracket that hooks to our firewall and that plunger touches the brake pedal arm. And in terms of installation, getting our stoplight switch installed really isn't too bad. It's just kind of tight underneath our dash, but it's definitely something that can be done at home. With that being said, we can take it in the shop and I'll show you how to get it installed now. Now we're ready to make our connection from our stoplight switch to our control module for our braking system. We're gonna be taking one of these wires and connecting it to the black wire. And we're gonna be connecting this red wire to our power wire that runs to the battery. To do so, we're gonna use our provided butt connectors. I went ahead and hooked up everything for our stoplight switch and our indicator or transmitter for our braking system. Off of our brake light switch, one red wire, like right here, is gonna go back to our transmitter. Then our other wire is gonna to go to power. Then from our transmitter, our white wire is gonna to go to ground with the black wire from our G-Force controller and our operating unit. We're gonna be removing this 13 millimeter nut right here and our bracket is gonna to bolt to that and then come down to our brake pedal arm. <clears throat> this is how we want our bracket oriented. We're gonna have this flange side kind of facing down onto our brake pedal arm. We can just come back and tighten down that 13 millimeter nut. Now we're gonna grab our stoplight switch. We want this plunger on the end to compress completely on our brake arm. I just backed that nut off the back. We'll just take that, push it through our hole. We'll just back that nut out until we can feel that totally bottomed out. And right there should be pretty good. So we actually don't wanna to touch this backing nut anymore. We're just gonna hold that through and then thread on our bigger nut with our star washer. Our stoplight switch sends a signal to our transmitter in this case, but if you don't have a coach link, it'll send a signal to your indicator light. So whenever we press the brakes, you can see those lights light up, letting us know that our stoplight switch is working properly and sending that signal. That's gonna allow us to know whenever the brakes are being applied. With everything tested out, we're ready to hit the road. That's gonna do it for our look at and our installation of Roadmaster's stoplight switch on our 2018 Ford Focus.